Hi there guys, how you doing? This is Jag, your Office 365 daily vlogger. I create daily Office 365 videos talking about various aspects of how to roll out Office 365 and, and telling you some tips and tricks and so on. Anyway, this week we've been talking about Microsoft Stream and uh, we spoke about what is Microsoft Stream, some of the, we've touched base on some of the use cases and yesterday we even spoke about external sharing of, of um, the, the lack of external sharing in Microsoft Stream as well. Today I just, just want to talk about um, about Office 365 video and and Microsoft Stream. What, what are the different key differences and why do we have both and you know what's the best way going forward. So Office 365 video has always been there with the, um, it's it's again a, a video uh, storage mechanism like uh, before Microsoft Stream was released uh, the only option to store video in Office 365 is Office 365 video uh, and then Microsoft released Microsoft Stream but now we ended up with two different uh, products which seem to be doing the same thing. So the idea there is is Office 365 video app will be deprecated. So going forward, you know, the app will will go into the sunset. Um, so if you already have videos in Office 365 video app, uh, Microsoft is is starting to you know roll out a migration service to to bring those videos across into Microsoft Stream. Uh, but if you if you haven't actually started on this video uh, use case yet. Then, then I would encourage you to look into Microsoft Stream and not into Office 365 video. Just disregard Office 365 video. Um, there's also a way for you to actually stop showing Office 365 video uh, app in your app launcher. So what's the difference between uh, Office 365 video and Microsoft Stream? Is like Office 365 video is an older version and uh, it, it doesn't it, it does provide you with video cap storage capabilities. It gives you a capability to create groups, channels, and playlists and things like that. Uh, similarly, Microsoft Stream does that as well. So the key difference though is Microsoft Stream comes with intelligence built into it, like you know, deep searching, auto captioning, and you know, facial recognition and, and so on. We'll, we'll talk about each of these AI capabilities in, in greater detail in the coming videos. But for now, the key difference is Microsoft Stream is, a, is the uh, the late uh, is the is the modern way of storing videos in the create channels and, and groups and whatnot. There you have it. Uh, that's a quick uh, uh, you know topic I wanted to talk about uh, uh, the differences between Office 365 video and Microsoft Stream. So tomorrow, stay tuned. I'll come back with. Uh, um, more Microsoft related Microsoft stream related content. Thanks and keep watching my videos and also connect with me on LinkedIn if you haven't. Cheers. Bye.